This is chapter one, programming exercise 13, algebra, solve a two by two linear equation. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna write a program that solves the following equation and display the value for x and y. Right here we got 3.4x plus 50.2y equals 44.5, 2.1x plus 0.55y equals 5.9. You can use Kramer's rule to solve the following two by two system of linear equation, provided that a d minus b c is not zero. All right, so how do we solve it in programming terms with Java, right? Well, we're going to use Kramer's rule to solve this exercise. We're going to do we're going to have four steps to this. First thing is we're going to find a determinant d by using the x and y values from the problem. Two we're going to find the determinant dx by replacing the x values in the first column with the values after the equal sign, leaving the y column unchanged. Three, find the determinant dy by replacing the y values in the second column with the values after the equal sign, leaving the x column unchanged. And then finally, we could use the Kramer's rule, use Kramer's rule to find the values of x and y. All right, so the first thing we got to do is find determinant D. So we're given 3.4x plus 50.2y equals 44.5 and 2.1x plus 0.55y equals 5.9. So to find determinant D, we're going to put this inside uh, this uh, 2 by 2 uh, matrix right here. We're, where the first column is going to be the first, the x values, 3.4 and 2.1, and the second column is going to be the 50.2 and the 0.55. All right, with that, we could, we could solve for d. So d is equal to 3.4 uh, multiplied by 0 0.55 plus 2.1 times 50.2. That is 107.29. So now we have find, we really found determinant d. Next, we have to find determinant dx. So for dx, uh, for that, we're going to have to grab the uh, result of x plus y and place that onto the first column. So as you can see, 44.5 is in the first column, same with 5.9. 50.2 and 0.55 uh, remains in the second column, and we'll do uh, 44.5 multiplied by 0 0.55, right? Add it with 5.9 uh, times 50.2, and we get the result of 320.655. That will be dx. And next, we will find dy. So dy will get the first column, 3.4 and 2.1, place that in the first column, and the last one, the, uh, the result, in the second column. And then we cross multiply 3.4 times 5.9 plus 2.1 times 44.5 and our result is 113.51 finally we could solve for x and y now that we know that d is equal to 107.29 dx is equal to 320.655 and finally dy is equal to 113.51 we could solve it with the formula where x is equal to dx divided by d or 320.655 divided by 107.29, which is 2.988. And y is dy over d, which is equals to 113.51 divided by 107.29, which is equal to 1.057. So our solution is x comma y is equals to 2.9 comma 1.0. All right, so now that I've broken all of that down, why don't we write that out in uh, as code, all right? So as code, we're going to solve, first solve for D, uh, for determinant D. All right, now what I want to do is grab this and write that down here in my um, program. And I'll say, first thing I want to do is find determinant D by using x, y values from the problem. And to do that, well, since it's given here, all I'm gonna do is grab this right here. 
All right. So basically, I know that D is this system out that print um, D is equals or determinant D is equals to this this value right here. Okay, so we're gonna run that. And we get 107.29. Okay. Next thing we want to do is find uh, the second one, find dx. And to do that, it is basically this formula that I've written right here. All right. I'm going to paste that in here and we have our dx. Now to find dy, the formula that I've ran now over here. And here we go. We have our determinant D, determinant DX, and determinant DY. Finally, to solve for X and Y, simply have to do dx over d and dy over d so we're going to grab that dy um, our, our y value which is uh, dy over d and we have solved it right so this so uh, Java is more precise in this number it's a little longer so x comma y is 2.9 comma 1.05 all right so hopefully all of this makes sense I'm going to do one more quick uh, brief review right so given the two by two linear equation right here, we'll use Kramer's rule to solve for D, which is basically put these numbers in a two by two matrix to, <clears throat> to solve for D. We have uh, X, uh, the X values as the first column, Y value as second, and we cross multiply, uh, and then we add the value. So that's D, that's how we got 107.29. To so solve for dx, we grab the last value right here and place in the first column. We maintain the second value right here as the second column, cross multiply and add them together to find dx. And then finally for dy, we grab the first column, place it there, and then grab the last column, place it in the second um, uh, matrix column, cross multiply and add them together. Finally, we have our d value, dx value, and dy value. With that, we could solve for x by doing 320 or dx over d, dx divided by d, 
which is 320 divided by 107. To calculate for our y is dy divided by d, which is 113 divided by 107. So dy over d is 1.0, and we put that together, it is 2.9 comma 1.0. So that is how we have it displayed over here in our programming exercise. D is 107, dx 320, dy 113, x comma y is 2.9 comma 1.05. Right, and that is how we solve this two by two linear equation using Kramer's uh, formula in Java.